what? My poor little old lady mouth. That little old lady's very grumpy, Sam. I know, Elvis. I know. It's so much f further than I thought it would be. I want to go back to the bus now. Oh, me too. My hands are like blocks of ice. We can't give up now. Remember, we are in the front row. And look, there's Newtown. Come on. I can see a shortcut. We're nearly there. Mandy, remember your Ponty Pandy Pioneer training. Always stick to the road. Follow me, everyone. But... We'll be there in no time. Mandy! I'm OK, Mum. I grabbed a tree, but I don't know how much longer I can hang on. <gasps> Hold on. Someone, call Simon Sam. That's better. A blanket with no holes. Soup that's just right. And a nice warm office. Well done, team. <laughs> Mandy Fan is dangling from a tree over a ravine. <laughs> Mandy Flood is dangling from a tree over a ravine. Tom, we're going to need you on the Newtown Road. On my way. I'll take Mercury, Elvis and Penny, you take Venus. Elvis, grab your soup. I'll bring hand warmers and blankets. She's down there, Sam! Mandy! It's Fireman Sam! I'm coming to get you! <gasps> Please hurry, Sam. Lower the double harness, Tom! Coming right up. Tough too, Mandy. I got you. Oh no! You better call Fireman Sam. The theatre's been fire checked, sir. Splendid. And how are the stars of the show getting on? Then, after your line, I come in with my part. And oh, look, sir, watch. Not now, Elvis. There's an emergency. Norman and Hannah have rolled into the sea on the prop pirate ship. Norman and Hannah have rolled into the sea on the prop pirate ship. Tom, we need you at the key now. I'm on my way. In a ship, we'll just float. Norman, it's not a real ship. It's just a prop. Wait, what? Oh, help! They're sinking! Oh no, you won't be able to swim. Don't worry, Norman. I've passed my gold swimming badge. I can swim better than you. Oh.
position to move, Tom. Water, Mandy, that's a petrol lawnmower. Ooh, uh, and that's fertiliser. You know what happens when you mix petrol with fertiliser? What? It explodes! Explodes? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. We'd better call Fame and Sir. Thank you, Nurse Flood. We really did learn lots about bandaging today. Yes, even if most of the practice was on you, sir. Well, after a busy day like that, I just want to go home and relax in my garden. Ooh. Ow. Uh. Uh. The, the flood's garden is on fire and oh, it might explode at any moment. My garden's on fire and might explode at any moment. Come on, team. Get everyone to safety. Okay, Sam. Penny, we're going to need the sticky foam. Okay, Sam. Come on, everyone. Get back behind Jupiter. You'll be safe there. Turn it on, Penny. It's out, Penny. All safe. Phew. Not quite. Make way for... Oiled Thunder! But, but the, he's a grown-up! That's against the rules! The rules are... There are no rules. Right. Are we ready? Room for one more! What is that? Say hello to the Rocky Blaster 2000. Oh, I take my fluffy flag to the finishing line. Please don't let it blow up. Three, two, one! Please don't let it blow up. Ignition! Rocky Blaster coming through! This is so completely unfair! I 
like speed. Towards the key. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh! He's gone off the end, eh? <gasps> He's heading out to sea. I usually do that. We'd better call Fireman Sam. Joe Sparks is heading out to sea at speed on a rocket powered hover cart. I'll take Juno, you two take Neptune. I might need backup. Desert Island and have to draw a face on a football so I've got someone to talk to! It's amazing up here! I can see the whole of Ponty Pandy! What's happening? The bracing's come off. Norman, you did screw all the screws in really tight, didn't you? Yes, of course I... Uh, oh, um, whoopsie. Oh. Oh. We need to balance out the weight. Norman, you're going to have to stay in the middle to keep it balanced. Me? Uh, Derek, you go in the middle. You were first up. No, I wasn't. You were first. And you pushed in. Be quiet, you two. No one move or the whole thing might fall. I really don't like tree houses. What are we going to do? There's only one thing we can do. Help! Those, what, what is it, Nipper? Oh, someone's in trouble. Come on. Help! Help! What's happened, Trevor? The bracing's coming apart. We can't move, or the whole tree house will fall. I'll go and call Fireman Sam. <laughs> the Punty Pandy Pioneers are stuck in the tree house. <gasps> We'd better hurry. Thanks for the lesson, Tom. I think it might be about to come in very handy. Fireman Sam! Hurry, Uncle Sam! Oh! Quick, screw in the other end of this pole tightly to the tree. It's in tight, Sam. Well, you're all safe now. A record to break. Not before I do. <gasps> Baked beans? Of course. That's it! A bath 
tub. Of course that's it. James, Sarah, over here, quick. Hi, Derek. What's happening? I need your help with this old bathtub. But quickly, I'll explain on the way. That doesn't look very safe, Norman. I'm fine, Mandy. Start the stopwatch. I'm going to beat the baked bean can squatting record. That'll show silly old Derek. <laughs> OK. That's the plan. It looks scary. Right. Give me a push. A big push. Oh, hey! Quidditch Book of Records, here I come! Uh, Mandy, how am I doing? Another 20 seconds and the world record is yours. Yes! Whoa! is dangling dangerously from a bridge. Saved by the bell? Norman Price is dangling dangerously from a bridge. Wait right there, my precious. Help is on its way. I can't hang on much longer, Mum. <laughs> You're safe now, Norman. There. Are you all right, Anna? Yes, I'm fine. But look what you did. Why can't you ever do anything normal? Why do you have to be so embarrassing? Oh, I'm sorry, lover. I don't mean to embarrass you in front of your friends. But you do! Is everything all right? Everything's fine. I would just like a regular sausage cooked on a regular barbecue with no silly hats involved. <laughs> all right, Hannah. Look! The bottle! Move back, everyone! It's spreading! Stop! We're moving towards the cliff! We're trapped! Oh! This time you really do need to call Fireman Sam! Oh no! My battery is flat! Now what are we going to do? We can use my hat! The solar panels have got a power adapter! There! Grass fire at the ruins, and people are trapped on the cliff. There's a grass fire at the ruins, and people are trapped on the cliff. Get in vertication again. Oh, uh, what are we going to do? <gasps> it's Uncle Sam. Penny, you hose down the grass. We'll get the floppy shovels. Okay, Sam. 
Make sure everyone's okay. We need to get this fire under control. Talkie. Oh no! I hope my fossils aren't broken! We need to get help. How about Grandad? He could call Uncle Sam. It's okay, Moose. We're getting help. Now, what's this about your fossils? James, Sarah, what a lovely surprise. <laughs> Moose has fallen down a ravine and is stuck between two big rocks. Oh dear. Uh, uh, stay calm. N no need to panic. And call Fireman Sam. Oh, I just don't know what's got into Cridlington today. Now he's gone and hidden my helmet. It's almost as if he wants to lose his job. Moose Roberts has fallen down a ravine and is stuck between two big rocks. <gasps> I'll call Tom. Come on, Penny. to the gully. Come on, Moose. Let's get you out of here. It's no good. I'm stuck fast. Hang on a minute. It's not you that's stuck. It's your rucksack. This should do the trick. Thanks, Sam. Nice job. That turtle does bob about a bit, doesn't she? Chicken pasta back, sir. I think I'll just go out for some fresh air. I can't move for much longer, Mandy. My arms feel like they're going to fall off. Be quiet, Norman. That wasn't a turtle either. It was just a log. I want to go home. The waves are getting huge. Oh, all right, Norman. I suppose I'll never see a real turtle. So which way do we go? Um, that way? I said that way, Norman. OK. <laughs> I'm trying, Mandy, but the waves are taking me this way. But that's taking us towards... like she's going along the coast. Yes. She certainly doesn't mind the sea being a bit rough. Wait a minute. What's that? It's a rowing boat. That's Norman and Mandy, and they're heading for the cliffs. But where? 
There's miles of cliffs along the coast. Look, they're near the lighthouse. Norman and Mandy are in a rowing boat and heading towards the cliffs near the lighthouse. Got it. And on my way. will send us into the cliffs too. Just hold her steady. Ready, Tom? Roger that, Tim. Up and away! Ah! Ah! Got you. Now back to Neptune, Tom. <laughs> What's about me? Don't worry, Norman. I'll be back. Finally, my lovely cup of tea. Norman Rice is lost on Ponty Panty Island. Come in, Penny. We have an emergency. Take Neptune to the Ocean Rescue Centre. We'll be ready with Saturn. Over. Right you are, Sam. On our way. Let's hope Saturn can see better than us. Anything? Come on, Saturn. I've got something. Saturn's found Norman on the secluded beach. Hold on! you. See them anywhere. Lily! Sarah! Where could they be? I better call Fireman Sam. Sarah and Lily are lost on Ponty Pandy Mountain. Sarah and Lily are lost on Ponty Pandy Mountain. I'll head to the mountains. You call Tom Thomas, sir. Right you are, Sam. Thank you. 
They're not just lost, Sam. They're in a tricky spot. I'll use the winch. Can you get me any closer, Tom? I can't, Sam. We're too near the rock face. We need to find a safe place where I can reach you. What are you doing, little sheep? He's showing you the way to safety. If you get up there, we'll be able to reach you. Come on, Billy. Thank you, sheep. Got you, Lily. I'll be back for you in a second, Sarah. Hold on. Ah, your turn, Sarah. I'll drop you back on the mountain top, Sam. No need, Tom. I'll make my own way up. Ah. <laughs> now that he thinks I'm a dog, I show him how much I love taking a bath. Now, I just need to step out of the bath, and then Radar will get in. Whoa! Whoa! Radar, stop! Come back! Uh, well, now I feel a little bit silly, eh? Round three, the 100-meter pet and dash. 20 bonus points to the winner. Ready, steady, go! And they're off and racing. Mandy and Nicola take the lead, followed by Sarah and Lion. Coming in at third place is Norman and Woolly, who stops to eat some tucker. Come on, Woolly! And racing up the rear is Norris, fast as lightning. Oh, Nipper would go so much faster if I wasn't holding him back. Nipper, if I let you off the lead, do you promise to behave? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Run like the wind, boy! Sam. Fire at the whole fish cafe, a nipper and lion are trapped inside. Can he be? We've 
looked everywhere. Look! Ah! Found you! There we are. The sausages are ready. Ooh, uh... What's that? That log sounds like my Norman. Look out, Dillis! Oh! oh, Trevor, you saved my life. My precious boy, what's happened to you? Trevor! The camping stool! Oh, my. I think I'd better call Fireman Sam. There we are. Perfect. Ugh. Solid as a rock. Well done, you two. Oh, and not a moment too soon. There's a forest fire and Trevor, Guinness and the children are trapped. There's a forest fire, and Trevor Guinness and the children are trapped. We've got a forest fire. We're going to need you, Tom. On my way. I'm a volunteer firefighter, you know. Oh, Trevor, you are so brave. It's Fireman Sam! A penny! Everyone stand back! Shall we use the sticky foam, Sam? No, Elvis. Just water for this one. Thanks, Tom. Looks like we have the fire under control now. No problem, mate. There. Hooray! <laughs> you all know Neptune. So that's the tour finished. Where have you been, Cridlington? Oh, sorry, sir. I got to bit them tied up. Oh, dear. Ooh, it's getting a bit breezy. Will Mike be all right out there? I'm sure he'll be fine. Oh! 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 oh what? Wait! Phew! <laughs> gotcha! Oh! Whoa! Oh, no. I've sat on my button. Uh-oh! Oh! Get off! Get off, you rocket! Oh, look, Mum! Fireworks! Oh, they can't be going off yet, James. They are. That's not just the fireworks. Mike's platform is on fire. I'll call Fireman Sam. Mike Flood is trapped out at sea on a blazing platform. Mike Flood is trapped out at sea on a blazing platform. Ben, you pilot type. Elvis and Penny, you man the water cannons. I'll take you. Oh, a 
I've got my whistle. I'm coming, Mike. I've got you, Mike. Nice job, Ben. That's it. Did I miss anything? Not really. That was very good, James. Wait! Mrs Chen, can't you do a bigger flash? Maybe if you used a lot of sodium. Put that down, please, James. Hey, who's for more football? Not indoors, Sarah. Uh-oh. I'll get the mop. Oh, Sarah, you just completely spoiled my science party. I didn't. It was an accident. No! No, Dad! That's sodium! Water will make it burst into... Th James is right. Everybody keep calm and move outside. Outside? Come along. But, but it was just starting to get good. I'll call Fireman Sam. <gasps> A chemical fire at the whole fish cafe? There's a chemical fire at the whole fish cafe. Mandy's there. <gasps> oh, no. And my Norman. Come on. Let's go. of chemicals are we dealing with? Elvis. Sodium! But there's all sorts of chemicals in there, Sam. Oh, I wonder what extinguisher Sam will use. I've got it. So have I. Because, because when in doubt, doubt you can't fight fire, fire with Sam. <laughs> you have got it. You put out the chemical fire, Elvis. I'll deal with everything else. Cheese. <gasps> and where's my little treasure? Uh, wait! <laughs> Slow down, cheese! Uh, ah, you're not getting away that easily, cheese! <laughs> no cheese and no Norman Price. <gasps> I smell trouble. I thought that was the cheese. Um, excuse me, Station Officer Steele, but, um... Norman sent the cheese rolling off the course and ran off after it. That's treacherous terrain out there. Oh, no. My little treasure is lost in the mountains. Oh. Don't worry, Dillis. We'll find him. But it's quite a wide area. We'd better call Fireman Sam. I'll go and get the helicopter. <laughs> Norman Price is missing in the mountains. Norman Price is missing in the mountains? This would have been the perfect job for Saturn's heat-seeking sensors. But Saturn's broken, huh? Sam. Hmm. Well, if we can't find him by sight, Elvis, perhaps we can find him by smell. You all to myself! 
just you and me out here, all alone, on this rocky ledge. Help! If Radar can sniff out the cheese and follow the scent, he'll lead us straight to Norman. Well, I've been holding the cheese all day. My hands really smell of it. Radar, go fetch. It's okay. I found him, Tom. Norman Price is on the west face. Roger that. Lower the double harness. Safe and sound. In there. Oh, it's getting very snug and warm in here. Why don't you take your scarf off, too? <laughs> no. Help! Norman! Sarah and James are trapped on the lake and the ice is melting! I'll call Fireman Sam. And now it's time for the most totally brilliant piece of winter rescue equipment ever! Sarah and James are stuck on the frozen lake and the ice is melting. Sarah and James are stuck on the frozen lake. Don't worry, you two. Fireman Sam is on his way. Elvis, the bag. I'm so cold. Don't let go, James. This penny, it's an inflatable rescue path! Ooh! Whoa! Whoa. Tie it to the end of the jetty penny, then hold it steady. Sarah, James, it's okay. We're coming to get you. Done. It's going to sink! Don't panic. I'm here. Got you. Oh, there you are. I'm not going to fail you this time. <laughs> Why, thank you, Your Majesty. Cridlington? Oh, dear. <laughs> um, ladies and gentlemen, the average Normansky! Amazing! Um, sorry, the amazing average Normansky! Poverty, poverty, bippity bat. 
I shall now pull a lion out of a hat. <laughs> hey, come back, lion. You've ruined the trick. <laughs> and I mean, um, no. that was meant to happen. Ta-da! Oh, cool. He's even got a smoke machine. Of course I've got a smoke machine. And now, for my next trick... <coughs> hey, I haven't got a smoke machine. Ah! <gasps> Fire! Everybody out. I'll call Fireman Sam. Station Officer Steele, Firefighter Morris and Firefighter Jones all pass the exam. Now, Cridlington. I've got a bad feeling about this. Fire at the Flood's house. There's a fire at the Flood's house. Penny, shut off the electricity. OK, Sam. Elvis, check that everyone is all right. OK, Sam. Is everyone OK? I think so. Where's Mandy? <gasps> oh, no. She's still in the box. Don't worry, everyone. I'll rescue her. <laughs> Thanks, Penny. Mandy? Mandy! <gasps> what happened? It's all right, Mandy. Everything's going to be okay. Come with me. Three smoke signals. That means an emergency. The pioneers must be in trouble on the island. I'd better call Fireman Sam. <laughs> no Sam in here. Now I can write my speech. There's an SOS coming from Pontypandy Island. Penny, take Neptune to the island and make sure the pioneers are safe. Right you are, Sam. for making the smoke signals. You're the best explorer here. We might even have time for sausages while help is on its way. But I'm the best explorer and I'm going to prove it. I'm going to send the biggest smoke signals ever. No, Norman, stop! says that uh, in the event of an island fire to uh, move away to the shore. Oh, yes. Well done, James. Now, life vests on everyone. There they are. Fire! Fire! Oh, no. I'm going to need some help. That's right, Sam. You check on the tea. Nothing going on in here. It's from Penny. There's a forest fire on Ponty Pandy Island. Elvis, we're going to need Titan. What about the fire? Oh, over there! Look, it's Fireman Sam! Penny, take Neptune and collect the skiff. Let's move in. Ready, Elvis? Ready, Sam! Ben, we need to move along the island and fast. Emergency! 
Taxi! Sorry! Station Officer Steele, Gareth, Sarah and James are missing on the river. And it's getting dark. We'd better take Saturn. I can stop the boat from moving. I'll help you. Ready? Now. <laughs> Don't you worry, Norris. <laughs> I've got you. I don't know how long I can hold on. They took the boat downstream. OK. Penny? Launch Saturn in that direction. It'll find Steel and the others by sensing their body heat. Elvis, I need you to direct me through the dark. OK, Sam. Sam. The rowing boat is at the top of the waterfall. You need to head 200 metres north, Sam, and quick! On my way. Ooh. He is steering this near! Oh. It's up for Sam! Gareth, I need you to tie the end of the rope to the boat! Saturn in. Everyone is safe. Oh, that's very dark. It's got to be dark for the really scary sleepover story. Cool. This is going to be the best sleepover ever. So, what's the scary sleepover story, Norman? It's called The Fog of Doom. Oh, once upon a time, there was a really scary person who lived in a really scary house. Am I a potato? No, no, let me think, let me think. N no, uh, wait, I've got it. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, no, it can't be that. Uh... He's been guessing for an hour now, Sam. Mm-hmm. Would you like a clue, sir? Oh, yes, cooking idea. You are something you wear, sir. I've got it! I've got it! Yes? No, no, it's gone again. And then the scary person pulled a really scary face. Will the fog of doom actually come into the story at any point, Norman? What? This is so boring. It's the scariest story ever. It's the fog of doom! Don't be silly, James. That's not fog, that's smoke! Oh, and it's coming from my sandwich! I'll get my mum and dad! Hot oh, Fireman Sam! I've got it! I know what I am! It'll have to wait, I'm afraid, sir. There's a fire at the Flood's house. There's a fire at the Flood's house! What were you 
you all doing out of bed? You shut off the electricity. OK, Sam. I'll make sure everyone's all right. Air, 100%.